I just reshot the whole video. <laughs> so I just did this now again. You guys better appreciate this. Like, I'm about to edit it, but you guys better appreciate this. Okay, what you're gonna need is hair ties. You're going to need some hair gel. You're gonna need some gel wax. You're going to need some black rubber bands, a toothbrush, a brush. You're gonna need a white tooth comb, some hair clips, and you're gonna need your molly hair. So I'm gonna start by detangling my hair. Make sure your hair is moisturized and sprayed with water before this. And then I'm gonna make a part from ear to ear. So I'm just basically making a part from one ear to the other on the front section of my hair. Please don't mind my brother-in-law because um, it's Sunday. There's gonna be some people in the house. So when I'm done, I'm just going to take a hair tie and I'm going to tie the back section off just to get that out of the way. And I'm going to take my comb and I'm going to part my hair right through the middle in the front section. So it's just a middle part. I'm gonna take one of my hair clips and I'm gonna clip one side of my hair back and then I'm gonna detangle this hair just to make sure that all the knots are out so I'm just using my tangle teaser here so now we're gonna start with the part so what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your comb and you are going to part your hair from the back and you're gonna go diagonally down just to create that triangle shape you can start from the front or you can start from the back and just part your hair diagonally down so what i'm doing now is taking some of that hair gel and i'm going to place it around the perimeter of my part so the triangle part that i just made and then i'm going to take the small toothbrush and I'm gonna brush some of the hair just to brush those flyaways to neaten up the section. I'm gonna take a black rubber band and I am going to tie that section down. Don't do it too tightly because rubber bands are really bad for your hair and you don't wanna snatch your edges. So here I'm just going around the base and I'm not even holding it tight. And then when I'm done, I just pull the rubber band down and then I'm going to pin away that section. For this part now, I'm going to start my triangle from the front so I can have opposing triangles. So it's the same principle, part diagonally but now I'm parting diagonally back so I can have opposing triangles if that makes sense and then I'm gonna do the same thing I'm gonna put some gel around the perimeter of my part and I'm gonna take a black rubber band and fasten it so 
I'm gonna do that for all the sections of the hair and then I'll be back sections I'm gonna take each section and I'm just gonna start to strand twisting each and every section so I'm gonna do twists for every section enjoy <laughs> yeah I'm just enjoying singing to some Sabrina and having some coffee just basically having a chilled Sunday and recording. Okay, and then after I'm done, I just like taking my gel wax and laying down my edges or my baby hair or whatever or lack thereof <laughs> just creating the illusion that my hairline's healthy which needs a whole lot of work i know but this is how i lay down my edges i do use the anti jackie gel sometimes but um the gel wax has a better hold but i don't use it all the time so that's how i do my edges I'm done with my edges I like taking my silk scarf and I'm just gonna wrap the front of my hair just to set the gel and to set our edges in place so when I'm done I just take my hair beads and I thread them through my hair using a bobby pin. I didn't realize that I wasn't really getting my method in the shot. Um, but you can use any hair pins or anything that you'd like to use to decorate your hair. You can use those gold uh, decals or you can use the silver ones. Anything really. done threading the beads through my hair um, I just like to take a hairbrush and I'm gonna brush the back section up and I'm gonna take a hair tie and I'm gonna tie everything up so I'm gonna put my hair together and just tie it in a top knot it doesn't have to be neat but just make sure your hair is tucked away securely So now I'm going to take my molly hair and I'm just going to fluff it out and then I'm going to fold it in half, okay, and then take a hair tie and I'm just going to place that underneath my hair um, where it's folded in half Then I'm going to take the one loop and I'm going to thread it through the other loop and I'm just going to pull so after i thread that i'm just gonna thread that through the loop and then i'm gonna pull and that's how i create my ponytail so once i'm done i'm gonna take that ponytail and i'm gonna tie it around my little bun that i made on the top of my head and i'm gonna flip that over to conceal the bun and then i'm just gonna fluff it out to my liking brush it out and 
make sure you can't see my hair underneath and that's it your eyes glued on my channel and share this video and thank you so much